many actors feel so strongly about animal welfare, they use their celebrity status to try to improve the lives of farm animals. Here you can see media personality Jackie O in a publicity shoot with a piglet. In Australia, Compassion in World Farming and other animal protection groups believe there are kinder ways to treat our farm animals. These organisations work effectively to improve conditions for them. Please sign a postcard. In a democracy, changes can be made by ordinary people collecting petitions, collecting evidence for court cases, holding peaceful demonstrations and vigils, and meeting with their members of parliament. It's only fair and just that these... The people attending this vigil in Melbourne are protesting against the live sheep trade. Many Australians do not agree that live animals should be shipped to the other side of the world just to be slaughtered. Following years of public pressure in Australia, the wool industry has agreed to phase out the cruel practice of mulesing sheep. It's extremely painful for sheep when the loose skin is cut away from under their tails. Mulesing is done to prevent flies gathering under the tail because fly strike can kill the sheep. But due to public pressure, more humane methods to stop fly strike will be used by 2010. Overseas, public pressure has already brought about welfare changes for farm animals. Single sow stalls are now banned in Britain. And battery cages will be banned throughout the European Union from 2012. In Australia, campaigners are working hard to have them banned here too. In this film, you've seen that farm animals are intelligent and sensitive, feeling creatures. They have the ability to learn and respond to affection like we do, and they can hurt like we do. In the last 60 years, we've kept farm animals more and more intensively in our efforts to provide cheaper food. This has caused a lot of animal suffering. So far, Australia has no laws to stop them being raised in this way. But is this right? Australia is known as the lucky country. However, many of our animals are not so lucky. It's Alan Pig, yeah, he's out here in front of Parliament House right now. By exercising your right to choose, you can improve their welfare. You can do this through the food you choose to eat. And you can speak up for the animals who can't speak for themselves. How do you think we should treat farm animals? <laughs>